And within the past two hours, same sex couples began marrying in Jackson County. This is because of a federal ruling handed down today. Sayed Shabir, live at the Jackson County Courthouse. Uh, Sayed, no matter where you stand on this issue, this is an historic day in this city. It is, Justin. Very historic day today. At 10 o'clock this morning, uh, John Kenny Rodericks and his partner, Robert Gann, came down to the Jackson County Courthouse hoping to get a marriage license. At first, though, they were denied, but with a little luck and a little patience, they were able to get the first same-sex marriage license in Jackson County. They had to wait, though, for about four hours in the Recorder of Deeds office, uh, but they finally got what they came for, and they didn't waste any time. Soon after that, they headed up one floor where retired Judge Vernon Scoville conducted their actual wedding ceremony. After being in a relationship for nearly eight years, they finally heard the words, husband and husband. The overturning of the ban on gay marriage in Jackson County, they say, is a huge step for the state of Missouri. To have that reversed and have equality across the state is a huge victory, not just for, not just for GLBT couples, but I think for everyone. I think marriage will become more valuable to everybody who's, who's married. And this came as quite a surprise for both of these young men, and th they're just soaking it all in. In fact, they were having a little fun with the media, saying, you know, they've been bombarded by all these camera crews and newspapers and uh, magazines, the AP, but they didn't mind because they said they didn't have time to hire a wedding photographer, but here they were with six news cameras documenting their big day. But uh, coming up here at 5 o'clock, we're going to take you inside of that wedding ceremony and show you more of their historic ceremony. Justin, we'll send it back to you.